What's up? My name is John, and I create content to encourage entrepreneurs such as screen printers. Today I wanted to show you a step that will improve your screen printing. Something I learned. Yesterday I received a comment someone want to know about how to get clients. And I told them if you haven't gone and go after clients, the best way to start is by start with your friends and family members. Go, go to them and try to sell the pitch and then ask them for their feedback on it. what should I change that will help you and then you could start heading to restaurants diners and put that sales pitch in action and once you start getting comfortable you start doing it more often just received the call I got a client coming in after the, I'm done with the client I'll be back and we get started with what I want to show you. Client just left. I love their first reaction when they come into the shop. The first thing they say is, nice clean shop. Nice and clean, dust free, ink, no ink drops all around. You know, especially if you have ink drops around, you don't know if you touched it, you have it in your hand and you touch a shirt, you messed up the shirt. When it comes to dust, if you washing screens and you putting them away, you're not gonna coat them at that right after you wash them. They're gonna sit around and if your place is dusty, those screens are gonna get dust in. So when you put the emotion on and then you wash the stencil off and you have some issues, think is the dust. So keep your shop clean. Let's get started. Today's tip is establish proper off contact. To get a crisp screen print on your product, you need to set proper off contact before you start printing. What is off contact? Off contact is the distance between your screen and the palette below. What it does, it allows your screen to come gently in contact with your shirt while printing and pull cleanly away, leaving a nice precise What's the distance between the shirt and the screen? Of for t-shirts, like a 1 16 of an inch, which what I use is cardboard. Is the size of a nickel. As if you have a hoodie, put the hoodie first on the palette, then come and bring the cardboard, and then you adjust. Look behind the clamp that's holding the screen. Usually you will have it on the back. There's one here, one there. And that's what we're gonna untighten and then we're gonna adjust by going up or down and setting it off on the cardboard. First thing you do is loosen it, come to the other side, loosen it up. Now they loosen, you see that you could adjust by going up and down. That's what you wanna do. Set up the pallet, you already loosen this up. Bring the cardboard, I bring the pallet down, and as you see, how it is tilted, now it's nice and straight. Hold it down in the, here in the front of the pallet, just a little down, just to keep it straight, and tie it up. Once you have it tightened, you lift. Bring down. Now you will see the off contact. You see? There's an off contact here. You're not touching the pallet. And there goes the off contact. If you notice that it's not, the screen is not touching the pallet. And that will help you to get clean, crisp, precise prints. So, if you like this video, press that like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. May God bless you all. Be grateful and peace out.